y'all, it's Ronnie, and yes, I'm headed to school. We're supposed to be on Christmas break, but they switched our schedule. I'm mean, literally out of school right before Christmas, and I'm going to be making a video um, tonight when I get out of school, but yeah, I'm going to pick up where I left off, so yeah, bye. What's up guys, it's Swanee and today I am back for Vlogmas Day, well Vlogmas 2, Vlogmas Day 2. It was kind of like a, a long distance between the videos, but who cares. But today I am back making a Christmas treat. It's called like Christmas Crackle or something like that. It's like with pretzels, okay so this is easy. It's with pretzels. These pretzels and you have to like spread them apart. You can also use crackers for it, but we decided to use pretzels and it's with um sprinkles. We got two types of sprinkles and we have our parchment parchment paper and we also have some like chocolate. I don't want to drop this. We also have like some chocolate that my mom cut up already. So it's like sprinkle it all the way. And we're also, so we already got the apartment paper set up. And my mom is, okay, so you also have to like, you have to put the pretzels and then make, you have to mix like sugar and, brown sugar. oh, brown sugar. You have to melt it with some butter. And my mom is gonna be doing that so we can get it ready to, put with the on top of the pretzels so yeah and now I just have to pour the pretzels on here and keep them close together and I'll be right back because I'm going to do that okay y'all I'm back so now I'm going to pour the cup of brown sugar onto the pan with the butter and yeah okay it's a cup of brown sugar you need a cup of brown sugar and like some butter But the butter, yeah, it's already melting. I'm gonna show it to y'all real quick. That looks very nice. And then it's gonna like, it's gonna make like a caramel consistency. Have you pronounced the word? Where it's gonna make like caramel kind of. So that's what. That's why we are melting butter with brown sugar. But now I'm gonna pour the pretzels onto the parchment paper. So I'm gonna be right back. Okay, y'all, these are the, this is the pretzels. We are all done, like, spreading them out. It has to be, like, together, no spaces, but not overlapping. But, but right now, I am just waiting for my mom to get done making, like, the caramel, butter, and sugar, I mean, brown sugar, butter and brown sugar, and it's looking pretty good right now. So, I'm going to get back to y'all when we pour it on the pretzels. Okay, y'all, this is the caramel on the pretzels. Yeah, it's like you have to fill in all of the stuff. We didn't really worry about the like, outside part, but it was starting to look good. And we just have to put it in the oven for a few, for like five minutes. And I'm going to be back on 350, five minutes on 350, but I'm going to be back when we get it out the oven. Hey, y'all, I'm back. So basically, I put the chocolate on there already and it's starting to melt i don't know if y'all can see that but we have to do it quick because it like it hardens very quick and then when we're done well when i'm done spreading the chocolate i'm gonna put the sprinkles and then we're gonna go put it into the refrigerator for about two to three hours so yeah now we're gonna add the sprinkles Okay, I don't know. I'm gonna have to open up the sprinkles. Okay. Oh, here you go. Can I sprinkle these on? Here, use these. Okay. This side is for the small ones, and this side for the other. And sprinkle them just a little bit, like, be careful. Okay. This, these are the sprinkles. Yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, it looks good. 
Oh, it's, it's giving like Christmas. It really is. Okay, don't do too much now. Okay. Okay. Alright, here's the next one. Okay. Oh, it's giving like Christmas. Alright, so okay. Okay. we are done putting the sprinkles. This is how it looks. And now we are going to put it into the refrigerator and we will be back. I will see you in two to three hours. I'll be back. I'm back, y'all. It has not been two to three hours, but look at these Dunkin' Donut chocolate things that I got. Wait, it's kind of okay. But look at, I want to try them on the camera because they have, so the flips they have, they have Boston cream, brownie batter, and chocolate cream. So I'm going to try them with y'all. Wait, I'm about to rip it. Wait, hold on. I'm gonna be right. I'm gonna be right back when I get them open. Okay, I am back, y'all. I got it out the box. It has plastic over it. So now I'm about to open it up. Oh my gosh! Wait, let me back this up a little bit. Get my angles. So I'm gonna just try the chocolate cream first to see how it tastes. This reminds me of like the Hershey Kissy. Let's see how it tastes. Mm. It looks like this. I'm gonna break it apart because it already has like a crack in the middle. No, let me just bite it. It reminds me kind of like a donut. That's how. Is that more chocolate? It looks good. Yeah. What's in the middle? Let me see. Mmm, yummy. It's actually good. You could have put some of that on your um uh, your Christmas tree. Yeah, we should put this on the Christmas tree. This is good. Now you gonna eat all of it. You're not gonna eat all that candy. I'm not. Okay, you can try another flavor. But I'm gonna try another flavor. No, I was gonna say you can try another flavor on another video. Oh okay. <laughs> you know, all those sweet. Yes, I'm mom in the background. <laughs> well, I wanna try the Boston thing. Sorry, y'all. Okay, we're about to try the Boston cream one. That chocolate, wait, that chocolate cream one is good. This is how the Boston cream one looks on the box. That's what it shows. Boston cream. This is how it looks. This one is, I think it says it's, wait, the Boston cream is milk chocolate shell with Boston cream filling. So it's Boston cream filling. That's kind of good. But now I will actually be back and I'll see y'all in two or three hours. Bye. Okay, guys, it has been about two or three hours because right now it's currently 9:43, and this is how the treat looks after we just took it off the refrigerator it looks very good we're gonna break it up in this christmas container and yeah okay i'm gonna break it up now but first i'm gonna try one i'm gonna try this one it's very hard Okay. It's hard to break. Wait, I'm gonna be right back. Okay, I'm back. And we got all the, like, we broke all of it up into pieces and we already put it in the Christmas jar, kind of. I'm gonna show it to y'all in the jar. This is how it looks. It looks very good. I'm gonna try one. I'm about to try it on camera. Oh, and this is the lid for it. But I'm about to try one on camera. Okay, I'm gonna try this one. It's very crunchy. And, oh, sorry. It has a lot of like, it tastes like caramel. Which is very good. Y'all need to go make this right now. It's very good. But, wait.
Well, I better come up here and get one of these. But it's really good. So all of the ingredients, it was just brown sugar with mixed with butter, melted in the pan on low. Stir it up for about three minutes or so. And then you add your chocolate so it can melt and your sprinkles and then put it in the refrigerator for two hours and 30, I mean, two hours to three, three hours. Um, that's how you get it. Oh yeah, and we baked the um pretzels and caramel for five minutes, so it like melt a little bit. We then put the chocolate on top so the chocolate can melt with it. But I'm gonna end this video right here. Make sure you like, subscribe, and share this video so I can get more views on videos. And I will see y'all in the next video. Bye. Wait. Oh, I forgot. I'm about to show y'all our whole Christmas tree. Just because I'm going to show another video at the end, but I'm just going to show it again. Top. Got all those, some candy canes too. And we got all these like sunflower things. And then we have the presents at the bottom. It's very nice. Now we are going to end the video. Make sure you like and subscribe and share so that I can get more views on my videos. And bye. See you in the next video.